In this video, we're going to give you a brief overview of the Janome 2030DC G. The G stands for great, and that's the new color scheme on the 2030. The 2030 has been in the Janome line for several years now. We've sold hundreds and hundreds of this model over the years. It's a very well-rounded model. It's the beginning model in the DC series. The first thing you're going to get on this machine is you'll have 30 of the most popular stitches that are built in. I can adjust the length and the width on all my sewing patterns. My computer board is laid out very easy for me that I can move over and change my width, move over and change my length, and then here I can change my stitches and I know exactly what stitch I'm going to be on. The machine will recommend the correct presser foot for me to have on it. All the Janome presser feet have letters indented to them, and all you have to do is make sure you have that foot, foot on the machine. It does have the horizontal spool pin. There is a place here for a vertical spool pin. So if I have a spool thread is sitting up and down, I can do that. I can also twin needle sew with this machine. It has the top winding bobbin on it as well. The machine does have the needle up, needle down feature. Now there's times I wanna have my needle in the garment. If I'm turning a corner or I'm appliquing, it's nice to have that in down position or I can have it set in the up position every time I stop so I never have to worry about my needle being in the fabric and me tearing a hole in or accidentally jerking the fabric and breaking the needle. This is a really nice feature to have on a machine, the auto lock feature. Auto lock ties that stitch up underneath for me so it's hidden and out of the way. You'll never see it but the stitch is securely locked. I still do have traditional reverse, but if you've ever noticed on garments that you have with the reverse, you can see that back tack on top. So you can do either one. The machine does come with an electronic foot control, but we do have start stop here, so I can use it instead of my foot control. Either way you like to go, some people really like that feature on a machine. The path to threading this machine is really easy. Everything is channeled all the way down to my needle, and I do have the built-in needle threader on this machine. Now it is a top drop-in bobbin system on this machine. The needle plate has markings for seam allowances. This machine has the extra high lift on the presser foot. I have seven places where the feed dogs is touching my material. So for lighter weight materials, it's really going to help feed those materials through, reducing the likelihood of puckering on those materials. Because it is top drop-in bobbin, it's going to be very smooth. The vibration is going to be very low on this machine. And I can see my bobbin at any given time, so I know how much bobbin thread I have left. Now, the machine has a removable accessory tray, but I like the ones where the tray folds outward so I can get to my attachments. But when I want to do the hemming, all I have to do is remove that, and I have the ability to do a shirt sleeve or a pant leg. On the back side of the machine where my hand is, there's a place I can actually drop my feed dog. So there's times you want to darn a hole, put on a button, or if you get into free motion quilting, because there's a lot of quilting attachments and other attachments available for the 2030. The 2030 is the most affordable model in the DC series, and Ken Sewing Center is an authorized Janome dealer. You'll get a full factory warranty with every machine you purchase from us, plus you get our premium service package. We're here to help you for the life you own your machine. I have four full-time technicians here to help you and you also can email us and speak through email to get questions answered after hours and we're glad to help you anytime so check out the website or give us a call and let's see if we can help you with this machine